What's going on, guys? Welcome to another episode of Masked Up Motor. This is your boy, Bobby Chulo, a.k.a. Daddy. We're here today with Zombie Dork 28. He's my uh, camera guy for today. So today we're gonna be working on this Dodge Challenger's uh, brakes and rotors with my assistant, Turbo. Hello. As well as my homie over here, Zombie Dork 28. If you guys are interested in his work, his car, he has some pretty interesting videos on his channel. And uh, if you're interested in this channel, subscribe, hit that notification bell on the bottom, and uh, let's get to it. Yo, yo, I'm like an addict, do I gotta have it? I ain't even playing, got a really bad habit. If it moves, gotta grab it. Fuse like a magnet, lose won't have it till I'm doomed in a casket. Alright, let's just put this thing in the What's this? Uh that's for later. Don't worry about it. Okay. Stay in power for a long time. Get up, nah, I ain't a quitter. Toss me the ball, I'm a really big hitter. Big picture, I'm a straight killer. Rise in the song to the highest bidder. All right, guys, so here we are, tires off. Um, we got these beautiful looking power stop rotors, and we're gonna put some fresh new brake pads on them. And uh, I'm just gonna walk you through the process. And uh, I have my assistant right here. Hello. Gonna give me a hand, right? Right, Turbo? I charge one treat the hour. Can you get me the correct tool? No treats, no help. Right here. Oh, whatever. Use 14. 14. Let's see if you're right. I'm always right. Wrong. What did I teach you? Nothing. All right, so it looks like right here, we got two bolts, 13 millimeter. I'm gonna see if I can crack these bolts loose. I'll put you back into it. I get paid for this. It's your car. <laughs> Finally, after some uh, struggling, ah, here's your problem. Looks like they put some Loctite in there. Somebody really doesn't want you to change your brakes. So what's the best tool for you guys to take out these uh, seized up bolts? Uh, let me know in the comments below. So after you take off the top and bottom bolt right over here, get a close up, my guy. Right over here, it says first bolt right down there another bolt down here kind of just uh symmetrical um once you get those things out you might need some pb blaster and your breaker bar of choice um as soon as you finish that easily be able to stick a screwdriver in here take off the actual brake like so easy now try not to let it stretch you don't want to like mess up your uh, brake line so uh i need another hand Problem solved. All right, so to take off the rest of the brakes, I have to put this 22 size socket right here. However, this doodad right here is in my way. So now I have to take this out. I believe that's a 10 millimeter. Zombie dork, if you please pass me the 10 mil. Thank you, sir. Nice. First try. <laughs> Alright guys, so how to take these bolts off. As you can see, the uh, array of tools that we have on the ground didn't have a breaker bar that fit. Um, so I had to make do with making my own and a lot of uh, PB Blaster. Delicious, very good stuff. Inhaled a lot of it, it's wonderful stuff. Um, I think in California it might actually cause cancer. So it's a, it's a good thing I don't live in California. So uh, I'm gonna start taking apart the pads, the rest of this. Forgot I left this one. All right, this is the rest of the brake caliper, and this should just come right off. All right, guys, so about three hours later, finally got the first one out. Now we just gotta put the first one back together. Kind of why I don't mess with uh, American cars. I finished my uh, Subi in like an hour. I'm still here for three hours on the first one. So right now we're just gonna clean up the caliper. Zombie dork, he wants to uh, wrap it so you could see how shitty our wrap job is. So um, yeah, we're gonna give that a shot and uh, you can roast us later for it. All right, first one down, three more to go. Looks pretty good. Figure I show you guys how it came out before we mess it up with a wrap and it's gonna look ugly and whatnot. Highly recommend, instead of messing with taking off the shocks, turn the wheel. 
there's a lot more room. So I had trouble just getting a lot of the bolts and extensions back here, but ended up taking this whole thing out. All could have been avoided if I just turned the wheel, but you know what? Maybe the next uh, three will be a lot easier, but yeah. Speaking of which, zombie door, can you pass me a 10? I got a... That's a... That's not a 10. <laughs> So it's been wrapped it's very bad. <laughs> you can see all the uh, lovely marks. Maybe um, instead of Brembo, we'll just put Rambo right here. So, you know, I think Rambo is better. What do you think, Zombie Dork? I think it's a good idea. Let's go yeah. find some. Like, well, happy. once he once he goes home and it's not there anymore, then it was a complete fail and a waste of like 20 minutes. But from far away, <laughs> I guess it looks okay. And uh, yeah, I guess we're going to do the other ones. All right, man, let's see what you got. <laughs> Weak. Oh, oh, nice. The other one, we were having a lot of trouble, but uh, looks like a good old sledgehammer did the trick. So uh, explain to me what you're doing. So I'm uh, picking up the old one. I'm going to try to stick this in his exhaust. So uh, we had to get the other side matching. So once again, here is our, uh, it wasn't that bad actually. This side came out a little bit better, you know, practice, I guess. But not looking too bad, it matches the, the red. What do you guys think? Yay or nay? What do you think? I love it, but that's because it's my car. All right, so it's not looking too bad. Look at that, guys. So far, we got one more to go. It's already nighttime. It's like, what, 10, 10 12? Oh, uh, we started like around noon and uh, yeah, so 10 hours. This one was probably the hardest one. Uh, we just got one more to go and you guys can see what it looks like when we're done. Please tell me that I can't, that I won't, that I fail, that I'll never make it out, yeah. You're still here? Oh, oh. He left. He, he left last night. I'm just cleaning up now. Um, tune in next week for another video. We'll do something different. Bye, guys.